Hello everybody and welcome back to Bloodborne and who oh boy I am glad to be back As you can see I've kind of up my arsenal a little bit Deal with them A little bit of extra damage here and there. Ow. Alright, let's clear you all out. Heal up. And now we're actually gonna continue the DLC after I give this girl a little gift. The balcony key, the balcony key. I know that key is used for something. I think it's this door over here. I could be wrong, though. Let me check. No, I was right. Which, if you look, doesn't this area look very familiar? It should. Which means a lot of this should look familiar if you know what you're looking at. Let's first go over here and pick that up. I mean, I don't need it. I'm PvP level now. But I'm going I know there's something I'm supposed to look for around here. <clears throat> I can't remember what it is though. Also, can still go through here if I want to. But I'll do that in a minute. Yeah, no, I don't remember the problem. This whole area is full of... Oh, crap! Whoo! <sighs> well, this is starting off rough. But I'll be if I ain't gonna try it again. I know it's doable, I just need to be a little bit more careful. Wonder is hunting. I mean, you're not wrong. Okay, let's pick them off one at a time. Oh, the Black Sky Eye. Actually, a really good item if you're doing Arcana. Woohoo! Nope. And this is actually good practice for the next boss I'm going to be facing. But first, let's heal up. much better but yeah while I was recovering I did a few chalice dungeons got some better gemstones in my weapon and maxed out my uh, PvP setup I don't no longer technically need blood uh, blood echoes but you know never hurts dead gummit motion controls Well, I guess it's time to go the other way. Because I know there's something I'm missing. First off. 
Wait, it says run. Oh, here we go. Yeah, no, you're not getting away from me. Beware of inquisitiveness. Um... Okay... Wait. Um... Oh! That's what it meant. Too bad I'm not a fool. Now let's see, what's in here? Eh, nothing good. Well, worth a check. Now then, the next two bosses. Hmm. How do I describe the first one? The first one doesn't scare me. It's the second one that scares me. But, as true to form. Oh, right, I need to take the elevator to uh, go up. Don't worry, I'll get your brain fluid later, as soon as I remember where the third one is. That's got the balcony key done. Unless there was a second area that I needed the balcony key. I don't remember, though. Slip through here. Ah, you hit. Ah, you hit hard. Okay, buddy. Whew. Let's get rid of you. And then figure where I'm supposed to go. Oh, here we go. Perfect. Pop a beast blood pellet. Rip the Chikage. And rush in here and start doing damage. Ow, I forget you guys hurt. Oh yeah, there's more than one of them. That's why I said they hurt. Ooh, nope. Oh yeah, they're also arcane throwing pains in my neck. Nope, 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 nope. Sky's not gone dark yet. <laughs> nope. Please tell me that did not kill. Dead gummit. Almost had him killed first try, too. Dang. Okay. Unrip the Chikage. Don't need to lose health before I get there. And I'm not too worried about losing, you know... Oh! She already moved locations. And to get the last thing of brain fluid, it's gonna sound crazy. Brain fluid. But wait. Ta da! Sadly, she passes away. However, we did complete her her trial, which gives us the milkweed room. If you're looking for item farming, that's what you need. 
Yeah, no, ignoring you. I need all my health I can get. And let's try this again. This is a DPS fight more than anything. Kill as many of them as quickly as possible. And don't let your health get too low. As we saw what happened. Me. Letting your health get low comes with consequences. Strafe. Strafe. Heal. Why the beast blood is still active. Oh crap. Um, um, um. Right, I need to be right here. Cool. Oh. Ow. <coughs> There's one. Oh. Nope. 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 Heal. Holy crap. Ow. The Astral Talk Clock Tower Key. Ow. Alright, that's one boss down. Now, where's my blood echoes? I don't need them, but I'd like to have them back. View Spectre. Is it just not here? Huh. Okay, then. Eh, whatever. I don't really need them. Now then, light the bonfire. And I'm going to do something smart first. Let's first go back here. Because this boss fight's gonna require all my skill. That gum and motion controls. That is one thing I'm not gonna miss whenever I go over to uh, my next game. No. Don't need you. Can I purchase anything new, though? No, no. And I can't get the armor I want until I beat the next boss on my lineup. So I'm going to four of those. Or can I? Oh, I can get the bone ash armor. Oh, nah, that's not the armor I want. As good as it looks, it's not for this build. The Lumen Wood Gardens. <coughs> Uh, sorry. Though I'm not sick anymore, thankfully. I still got a little bit of congestion. <clears throat> and good news, I didn't get caught with it, actually. I was caught with something else. Um, oh, what is it called? I had a si double ear infection and a sinus infection. Now, as you can see, we can't go through. Nothing else here except for this dead woman. Oh, she ain't dead. A corpse should be left well alone. Hi, you must be Lady Maria. Oh, I know very well how the secrets beckon so sweetly. Wild curiosity. 
city. Lady Maria of the Astral Clock Tower. And who oh boy, she is a fight and a half. <clears throat> if you know what you're doing. Oh! Yeah, this is not a time for blood. This is a time for knowing how to parry. Or in my case. Oh yeah, I forgot she has a pretty powerful shot. She also has a really cool weapon you can get. But it's a it's a skill weapon. Mm. Reload. Mind you, this is ow, phase one. Oh wow, I thought I dodged that. Yeah, I'm gonna cheese it a little. Yeah, no. Visual! However, I think I'm getting... Yep, yeah, phase two. Whew. Yeah, now she throws in blood attacks into the mix. No, I'll take my health back. Sit down. Beast Blood Pellet. Oh! -ho -ho! I forget she has full arena ranged attacks. And she's quick. Oh crap, phase three. Yeah, the blazing blood, which is the build I've been trying to work towards the entire time. Beast blood pellet, time to fight my blood of blood. Yeah, this is the, that's the one you need to back up from. <laughs> you see now why I went back and got blood vials. Nope, nope. And I have no bullets. No! Oh wow, they didn't kill me. Wow! She caught me with her own visceral. Whew. Yeah, she is going to be a problem. And I love it. This is the first Dark Souls level boss I've felt in this game for a while. Yeah, I know. Oh, but she's technically not a Dark Souls boss. I don't care. She gives that feel. She gives that taste of chaos that Dark Souls brings. Mm. 
But I need to go pick up some more uh, bone marrow ash. Yeah, I kind of bought up a lot of items while I was on uh, recovery. And this happened to be one of them. And if you wonder why I have the blue elixir stuff, PvP, it it works wonders. So phase one, I need to save up the bone marrow ash till phase two. <clears throat> Lemonwood Garden. <clears throat> and let's rock. <sighs> All right, Lady Maria. Let's dance. In phase one, I'm not as worried. It's phase two through three I start to worry. Heal. Pop a heal. I forgot you are quick. Heal up. Oh. Ow. Stop shooting me. All right, let's get you to next phase. Heal up. Get ready with some bone marrow ash. Freaking distance to heal. Yeah, no, I'm not falling for it a second time. Oh, I can parry you in this phase, too. <clears throat> no! Oh, crap. Crap. Heal. Ow. Heal. Denied. Whew. 
Last of a bullet. Whew. Whew. Last bullet to do that. Don't be fooled. Oh yeah, you gotta go all the way back and get this item real quick. Celestial Dial. Whew. That, folks, is why she has some serious respect in my book. Alright, I gotta be back here to do it. Which then opens up the clock tower. Which, don't let it fool you, that sunlight's all fake. Because you get here... And you have... Gotta be ready. Ooh, Madman's Knowledge. That'll help, because I think I need it to buy the armor I want. Welcome to the fishing hamlet. And if you're ever wondering about the Bloodborne symbol, that's technically what it's in reference to. How do I explain it? They do that to prevent someone from turning into a beast. Now then, go over here. No, no, no. Armor, that's what I needed to look at. Kanehurst armor. Tomb Prospector. Okay, I was making sure it wasn't in there first. Let's go up here. Should be able to... Oh, wait, no, never mind. Maybe it was the uh, Bone Ash armor I was looking for. Let me check. Oh yeah, there it is. That's the armor I've been waiting on. Huh, could have got that sooner then. Higher defense. Lighter. And much more effective. Plus, it kind of gives that undead dragon feel to it. The only thing I don't like about it is the hat. But, to the fishing hamlet. <clears throat> Alright, now this area has a lot of secrets and a lot of issues so I don't think I'll be able to make it through it all in one episode my advice be ready because there's a lot of enemies here that'll hurt for example these things I try to kill them quick because they hurt and they usually come in groups Blood vials. Yeah, no. Oh, there's the third one. Yeah, kill them quickly. That's my only advice. Although, if you're looking to farm up blood vials, this is the area. And 
And that's the first... That's the one in the... That is the only one in a non-dungeon area that's not bad. Whoa! 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 Yeah, no, I'm gonna go kill that guy now. Oh, that's the thing I worried about. Oh, they can be parried. Yeah, these things hurt like a bat. Up. Whew. That's the attack you need to worry about, though. Oh, oh the fact that I dodged that is a miracle. Yeah, no more mercy. Kill it. Kill it. Kill it. Ow. No. Oh. Oh. And one of the good weapons is behind two of those things, I'd mind you. And if you're paying attention, you wouldn't notice him. Although I did almost miss you. Good thing I'm quick. Blood vials. Is this the one that I'm thinking of? I think that's one of the ones I'm thinking of. Come on, heathens. I feed not the beast, but myself. For I am the only beast here worth feeding. Got you. And let's get rid of you. Anyone else want to try me? No? Good. Give me those blood files. You too. <clears throat> Yeah, Fishing Hamlet, no joke. Yeah. Odd Fire Damp Gym. Hold on. Oh, yeah, that's actually pretty good if you are running a fire build. Which is what I'm half running. Now... I'm going to descend a little, see if this is the one I'm thinking it is. Yeah, this is the one with two of them down here. Mm-mm. I need to get to the other part that's safe. There's one of them, you can get to jump on them. Ow! Disrespectful old heathen. 
I'm gonna shoot you to death. You threw a harpoon through me. Ow. Oh yeah, these things. The cur cross between a fish and a dog. Yeah, if you ever wanted to have a pet fish and also wanted a pet dog, Merry Christmas. There's your choice. Ow! Speed, you heathens! Fine then, you wanna bark? Bark! Wolf, wolf, heathen! Huh, thanks for the replenish of blood vials. Now let's go get your buddy up here. Oh, there's two of you. And one of you has some seriously bad aim. Yippee Kaye! Nah. Denied. Death. Oh! Another spellcaster in one. Yep. Your best bet with the spellcasters? Rush them. Their spells only hit at a distance. Oh! And then there's Big Boy here. Who has a weapon? Oh, crap. Gotta make some blood! Oh, I forgot the range on that thing. Ow. Bang! Heal. Y'all really thought you could take me out. I am the Hellfire Dragon. And you thought you could kill me. Nah, fam. No one kills me but me. Oh yeah, that's the shortcut. However, we can go forward. But we should get attacked by someone. There it is! Meet the Beastkin Hunter. He is parryable, it's just very, very difficult. But each time you kill his 
uh, thing there, you get his armor set. So before I go back and kill him, I'm going to go and... And I'm going to try to kill each of his summons. Once you kill all five of them, then we're going to go back and silence the bell. Out of my way. You'll know he's nearby when you hear his bell. Oil urns. Electromancers. Let's open up that shortcut. He ain't a big one, but I'll take it. <clears throat> Some blood vials. Okay. While I'm down here, I'm safe from the lightning. Because lightning comes from above, and there's a roof. One, two, three. Heal. Huh. He should have reappeared by now, and that's bugging me a little. He spawns four times for the boss. And once after the boss. And between here and where we're going is where the boss is. Yes, I could have went restocked, but I'm wanting to save my restocks for now, mainly because we do get a lot of supplies here. Oh, here's where I needed to go, the ladder. And I'm going to try to avoid doing anything crazy until I hear the bell. That bell is my indicator he's nearby. Oh yeah, these things. We saw one of them earlier, but it was already dead. I'm supposed to be getting attacked. Where is he? Bloodstone chunk. Oh! Did I miss it? All oh, right, the ones that come out of their shell move so much quicker. Oh crap! Yep, he spawned now. I don't know where, but he spawned. Sounds like it's coming from this way, though. It is! Awesome. Oh, what the? Oh! Two different targets. Okay, I'll give you props. No. Get back, get on the ground, and get away from me. Oh yeah, he has some ungodly amount of poise. <clears throat> Did that to get rid of him. Heal. Heal. Mm. 
Nope. Bloody trousers. That's two of the bell rings. If you're wondering why I'm not using that blood drag, I got all I need. Oh, I can't remember if that's the room I think it is. So first off, Madman's Knowledge. Whew, I'm very low on supply, but better late than never. Oh no, it's a shortcut. Great One's Wisdom. <sighs> I don't know where you came from, but rude. Couldn't even at least bother to drop me some more healing items. He went that way. Oh, Mind Flare. Okay, yep. This is a case of kill it quickly. No. Nope. There's more than one. I don't have any sedative either. Crap. I did not think that through. Who? Lead elixir? Nope. Do I have any other bonus healing items? I do not. Ow! to try to kill that thing. Oh, that's the boss arena. Huh. And what's this for? Oh, it's a shortcut. But to where? Hot diggity dog. That's what I needed. <coughs> oh boy. Okay, that could have went so much better. Sell those, sell those, these, that. <sighs> eh, I have better. Yeah, Frenzy Resistance is great. Hmm. I'm going to see if this one's better than the one I already have. If it is, hot dog. If not, eh. Not, no skin off my nose. Repair. Blood Gym Fortification. Hot dog. It's better than the one that was already on my Evelyn. Let's see. Can I get a better hat? Oh, wait. 
No, that was the one piece of armor I did want from Lady Maria. Reduces several things, but looks so much better with this set. Unless I can buy a better one. Let me check. Yarnum Hunter. Tomb Part Prospector. Kanehurst. Beak. Mm, let me see how the Yarnum Hunter's cap looks first. Better defense. Good frenzy resistance. Mm, that actually kind of fits with the set better. Sorry, late. Sorry, Maria. As much as I like your hunter's cap, I'm gonna go with this. Oh boy. Now before I end off this episode, I'm going to at least attempt to get into that area I was talking about. Past the mind flares. Mm, should I though? Let's see. Grab those. Top off that. And you know what? Ow. Let's be smart. And pick up some sedatives. Whew. There we go. And... Let's at least attempt. Lighthouse Hut. <coughs> Let's head back down this elevator. I should... Ooh, about missed you. King Cold Blood. Eh, it's okay, I guess. Have my sedative ready. And rush. <laughs> Back up. Sedative. And send it. Oh, crap! Sedative. Heal. Quicksilver. Curse Tempering Blood Gem. Ah, yes. This is where I wanted to leave off. Because this is the room I was talking about with those two big uglies. So, thank you all for watching. I'm probably going to record a part two of this afterwards. But, thank you all for watching. If you liked the video, please like, subscribe, share with your friends if you think they'll enjoy it. And until next time, rest easy, hunters.